great things about lentils is that they're not just good for wintry soups. They actually make fantastic salads. And this is a, is a riff on one of my favorite ones, which is like a really, really simple thing. We have here, um, these are French lentils, which have been cooked. You'll be able to pick up how to do this in a video on, this, on the site. We're going to put it with a little bit of red onion, a little bit of oil, some watercress. Now watercress, fabulous, super green. Everybody loves it at the moment. It's full of vitamin A, vitamin C, which are antioxidants. And also it has a lot of B complex vitamins as well, which are really great for your metabolism. And not to mention also it has a lot of minerals in it. So it really is a pretty nifty green um, to put in your salads. And it's also, you know, we're talking about salad and soup. This also makes really great soup. So we're going to make, put that in. And of course, everyone's favorite, avocado. And what's great about this is that you're going to get the creamy avocado along with the, uh, with the, with the salad. Now, we're going to start making the dressing for this right now. It's pretty simple. It's a sesame remoulade um, in as much we've got some vinegar. And then we're going to put in the differences that we're going to mix in some tahini. Now tahini, I just got some of this here so that you can see it. But this is how it comes. It's going to be creamy and thick. And these are toasted sesame seeds which are, are ground. And what happens is they, they're very oily. Um, and sesame is a very good source of iron, among other things. I'm going to put this in here. And this is going to give a kind of a creaminess. In a traditional remoulade sauce, it's made with a more mayonnaise-based um, system. But this, not this. So I'm just going to waste not what not, right? Put a bit of salt in here. There's a lentil that got away in there already. The mustard sauce is quite sharp. What the sesame is going to do is going to kind of mellow it out. Now, I'm going to put in some olive oil. And I'm going to beat it in quite slowly so that it blends in well. So you can see it's pretty well emulsified. I'm going to put in a bit, a bit of water as well. Not too much. Now I'm going to put in a little bit of the chopped onion. Save a little bit just for garnish. That's also going to help flavor the sauce. Now the lentils are going to go in there. Now I'm going to mix them in quite carefully. And don't worry, see this is, uh, we, you know, as you'll see, we cook this with whole garlic. That can go in there and it's, it's quite soft so you can kind of smush it and add it to the sauce. See how the lentils are holding the shape? This is because those French lentils really do, they don't go to, they don't dissolve. If you tried to do this with the regular soup lentils, you'd end up with, well, soup. Okay, so I'm gonna set this aside. You have to be careful when you do that, by the way, guys, because more people end up in the emergency room trying to get avocado pits out of avocados than anything else, apparently. So I'm gonna put that to one side. I'm gonna to get to use some of this really fabulous watercress. Now, when you're making something like this, you don't need the thick stems. When I'm making soup with watercress, I do keep these and I dice them up with the, and add them to the onion. But for this, we really just want the, the, the little leaves. Now I'm just going to give it a couple of... I'm not going to chop it fine. I just want to chop it a little bit. I'm going to mix it, mix, mix, mix it in. We're going to put a little bit more as garnish. But I can't tell you what a, what a tasty combo this is. Be careful how you do this. This is another emergency room waiting to happen. I'm just feeling, well, this knife is, is a Japanese vegetable knife, so it's a little bit safer, but it allows me to literally scoop out my avocado slices. Now I'm just going to get um, a bowl. I'm going to make a bowl of this, and then we put it together. You've got to eat with your eyes too, right? 